Okay. You should have called. I know. I'm just worried if I did, you wouldn't have answered. Can I come in? Sure. So how have you been? Trying to survive this romantic crisis. <laughs> Seems like you're doing a lot more than surviving. Is it wrong for me to be happy? No, John, that's all I've ever wanted for you. Of course, it's not wrong to be happy. I just don't understand how you could have moved on so fast. Look, what do you want from me? An apology? <laughs> no, I don't want an apology from you, John. I just wanted to get some closure. I don't know. You know, this was stupid. Just... Look, I, I didn't want it to be like this. Well, what, what do you expect this to be like when you break up with somebody of four years and then immediately go after another girl? I mean, you can't put a timeline on love. Love? So, so that's what you're calling it? You're calling this love? We weren't growing. We, we, our relationship plateaued. No, John. I was trying so hard. You stopped trying. And that's where we went wrong. You saw every conflict as some big mountain that we just couldn't get past together, even though we had been together for four years getting past all of the small stuff. I couldn't find the right time to say goodbye. I guess there is no right time to say goodbye when you're screwing someone else. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I don't know what I was expecting to find when I came here. I just wanted to get my shit back, so. Look, I, I prayed for us to work out. It, we, just, we just didn't. You prayed for us to work out while you're screwing someone else? Do you not see the irony in that? Wait, we're not like Wi-Fi. We're not always gonna have a connection. Maybe I'm, I'm not meant for you, or you're not meant for me. Maybe you're right. I'm sorry I barged in like this. Um, I just wanted to get my stuff, so. I don't ever want to hear from you again.